In this video, we will talk about the uniformly varied rectilinear motion, abbreviated as UVRM. Rectilinear motion is a motion of a particle along a straight line. It can therefore be described mathematically using only one spatial dimension to determine the position vector, the velocity, and the acceleration vector. The varied rectilinear motion is a rectilinear motion with non-zero acceleration or variable velocity. A variable rectilinear motion can be either accelerated when its speed increases or decelerated when its speed decreases. When it is accelerated, vectors a and v have the same direction, thus a scalar v is positive which leads to Ax Vx is positive and means that Ax and Vx have the same sign. When it is decelerated, vectors A and V have opposite directions. Thus, A scalar V is negative, which leads to Ax Vx is negative and means that Ax and Vx have opposite signs. The uniformly varied rectilinear motion is a rectilinear motion with non-zero constant acceleration. In this case, Ax is constant different from zero and its primitive Vx equals Axt plus Vx zero. And the primitive of Vx, x equals half Axt squared plus Vx zero t plus x zero. The equation of Vx gives t equals Vx minus Vx zero all over Ax. If we replace t by its expression and the time equation of x, we get what we call the time-independent equation vx squared minus vx0 squared equals 2ax into x minus x0 or delta x. This motion can be represented by the position time graph where x satisfies the equation of a parabola we will not be showing the other cases in this video. For the acceleration time graph, the function Ax equals constant is a straight line above and parallel to the t-axis when Ax is positive and below and parallel to the t-axis when Ax is negative. For the velocity time graph, Vx satisfies the equation of a straight line having Vx0 as its vertical intercept and Ax as its slope. Therefore, we can have six cases depending on the signs of Vx0 and Ax. Thank you for watching.